Alfred here, your guide to your own screwed up past. Because, yeah, the only way someone's actually watching this is if they're from the future. So welcome, future being, to your own screwed up past. Hopefully this will help you to never ever again enslave women. It sucks so hard. I've been thinking lately, Gilead is pretty terrible. But there are some things that are just like... They're just above and beyond. They're just the worst. Number one. Poll not reading thing? I used to be a librarian. I literally read things for a living. And now, women aren't allowed to read. The only word I see on a regular basis is faith, and there's only so many times you can read the word faith, people! Then there's the random Latin in my closet, which I mean, I'm sure has no significant meaning to anything ever. And then there's Scrabble and magazines with the commander. He invites me in his room to watch me read stuff. Like, who does that? Does it, like, turn him on? Woo! A woman breaking the rules of the country you're in charge of! So sexual! No, but seriously, the commander kind of creeps me out. Not kind of, he creeps me out. Like, a lot. Like, a big amount. Number two. You do not know bad sex until you've done it with your head in the lap of an old woman and the guy pounding away down there, seeming totally bored. And then, the other night when I finally did get some, with Nick. Oh yeah, that guy is smoking. Literally, he, he's smoking. He has cigarettes from the black market. Nailed that joke. You're welcome, world. But yet yeah, that good time only happened so I could get pregnant faster, courtesy of Serena Joy. Yeah, that'll probably never happen again, unfortunately. And if anyone finds out, we'll probably both die. Love and life. But the sex is bad and that really sucks super hard. Number three. The salvaging. Don't even really know what to say about the salvaging. Other than me and like all the other handmaids in town congregate and we have to literally pull the rope that hangs a handmaid or a wife who in the eyes of the government did something wrong. I don't think I need to explain why it sucks. I think you get it. It's really bad. Number four. I... I have a daughter... somewhere... in the world. She got taken when Luke, her, and I were trying to cross the border. So this whole... mess wouldn't happen. Uh... Yeah, I wonder where she is. I mean, they can't afford to waste girls, so she's probably somewhere being prepared to be a wife or a handmaid or a kind of wife or something, but still the fact that she is out there and I don't really know if she's okay, that really, 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 really sucks. Basically, the moral of the story is Gilead sucks. and. There's no enjoyment in the world, and it feels like everything good and nice is gone, except for flowers. I think I kind of hold on to that idea, that even after all this terribleness, and still flowers, still just a little bit of happiness. I hope there's still flowers in your world, future listener person. I feel like the world would just be a darker place without flowers there to brighten things up a little bit.